any money where I get at the flex, at the ball, failure and unhappiness. That's my biggest fear in life. All they just want to know is, oh, you are 30, you have not married you. Ha! Hmm. Hmm. Can you guys leave me alone? I be they will follow me to my husband's house. Me. It's just the wedding that they are interested in. After the wedding, or oh, yo, God help us. Welcome to Nigeria. 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 Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Laifa and if this is your first time stopping by, welcome. So today I'm going to be doing a chit chat, get ready with me. I'm going out tonight, so I'm just going to be getting ready doing my makeup. I already did my hair. My sister, Style by Dobra, did my hair and Laifa luxury hair as always. This is wig life i haven't worn wig life in a minute so yeah now i'm going to start my makeup i haven't done a chit chat get ready in a while well. and i didn't even realize until two people close to me brought my attention to it but i don't know if people really like it they're like no those are their favorite videos from me let me know in the comment section below so yeah i'm not giving you for what you don't want i didn't think you guys really liked chit chat get ready with me because i babble a lot <laughs> but since they brought it to my attention i was like okay let me let me let me do one today while i'm going out and guys i am pressed for time i thought i was going to do something over the top i don't know shall let's see let's just see how it goes so yeah anyways i put up on my instagram for you guys to ask me questions so i'll be answering them while i'm doing my makeup so yes let's get into this video all right so i just went to get my beauty sponge damp and i already done my skin prep and all that so i'm just going to go straight into foundation and for foundation i'm going to be mixing these two the patsbagrat in medium deep 26 and the estee lauder deep spice so the first question here is how are you doing oh that's such a thoughtful question to ask <laughs> i'm fine i'm actually fine right this second right now filming this video i'm fine right now thank you so much for asking how are you ha halema thank you so much for asking i really appreciate that what are your plans for december <laughs> same person <laughs> um i don't know the only plan i have right now is work 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 if you don't know i'm a makeup artist i was looking at my calendar for december and my calendar is full you guys it's so funny how every year i'm like this year i'm going to dirty december if you're not nigerian like december in nigeria is usually a lot of fun like we refer to it as dirty december every december i'm like this december is the december to remember <laughs> i'm always making plans for december and it never follows through like i'm always overworked but it not be firewood but i really would like to have fun this december i would like to go for a concert this december and not just go for a concert and stand at the back like i would like to actually come prepared and sit in front i don't know Sha. let's see by the way guys i do microblading now <laughs> in case you don't know so like my december is already almost fully booked like every weekend is booked in December <laughs> and I've not even added microblading like I'm sure I'll get microblading clients but that one has never been added to my calendar yet god help me <laughs> all right so next up concealer I'm going to be using the Huda Beauty concealer in combo I think yeah combo the next question did you ever visit worry <laughs> I grew up in Wari. I spent the first seven years of my life in Wari before I moved to Asaba. Wari is my backyard. <laughs> Literally. Did you watch the last Big Brother? Who was your fave and least fave? I did not watch Big Brother this season at all. Normally, even if I don't watch, I would watch online, like see posts and know what's going on. But this year, I don't know, I just wasn't interested in Big Brother this year for some reason. I have no idea why, but I was not in the least bit interested in watching Big Brother. I just know Shags. And you guys already know the reason why I know Shags. Guys, eh, in this life, eh, it's so difficult to speak out concerning 
anything because the backlash from people is crazy in case you're not in nigeria or you're not watching big brother so beauty by Gwemi made a video and it's, do you know what it's pissing me off i watched that video then when it happened it was like an hour long video like i think i didn't even watch it as it go i think i watched it bit by bit until i finally finished this relationship not a physically abusive relationship but and that's the thing that annoys me like nigerians have this mentality like did he hit you no he didn't hit you so it's not abusive it's not only physical abuse that exists guys uh-uh let me allow this counselor to dry a bit while i'm talking about this you can be in a relationship with someone that makes you feel less than not worth it makes you feel like you should be lucky that i'm with you that's abuse in case you don't know that's abuse being with someone that doesn't lift you up that doesn't make you feel good about yourself that's an abusive relationship so she was in an abusive relationship with him and she made that video years ago i think when, when this whole thing came up again i went to look for it but i didn't see it anymore apparently she's taking it down and she didn't even mention the guy i don't even know what happened now that everybody now knows it's shex she's referring to because she didn't mention the guy's name so the shex guy went for big brother and the whole thing resurfaced and everybody's like when is chasing clouds why did she not talk about it since until now that he has blown even if that were the case so what allow people to deal with their pain the way they, they choose to deal with it like the way people were coming for her eh? it was so sad oh, god so disappointing and it's usually women why because the shex is fine and has an accent i don't understand women eh well, our biggest problem if you see women in the comment section on Insta Vlog Niger, I wanted to enter the phone and slap all of them. Oh, even if that's the way it was, you're supposed to uplift him to change. Supporting bad behavior. And I was thinking in my mind, like, the guy's family, do they really not know that this is how their son or their brother is? I feel like it's people around that just enable people like this. God help us. Welcome to Nigeria. Nigeria, Nigeria. All right, they brought the light back. Praise the Lord. So, for setting powder, I'm going to be using my baby. I don't know, for some reason, people don't know that Mira Cosmetics is my baby. My partner, Chloe, and I own Mira Cosmetics. You guys should stay tuned. We're turning a year next month, November. Guys, we are in my birth month. For some reason, I'm not as excited as I was last year, like last year, like two months before everybody was already knowing my bed is coming, my bed is coming, but like I'm just really chill this year. But anyways, we are turning a year next month, so we have like a giveaway we're going to be doing and it's going to be big. So stay tuned for that. I'm really excited and by God's grace, I'm going to be launching a few products also. So keep an eye out for that. I added a bit more concealer. All right, so now I'm going to set. All right, so to set the rest of my face, I'm going to use another setting powder from Mirac in the shade Nutmeg. I tried this thing one day and I've been doing it since then. I just like how my skin looked when I did it. It looked really, really nice. So I've been doing it. All right, next question. When did you make your first million and for what job? <laughs> I've done so many videos about this in the past so many times. I can't remember when though. But like, it's, it's like a combination of my YouTube and being a makeup artist. I think I was 26. You have been giving hints like you'll be married before the end of the year. I so much love Isha. Ha! Pico, how have I been giving hints? <laughs> because I did that video with my mommy that she was saying next year. <laughs> We're just speaking in faith to <laughs> when you have faith about something you you profess it you confess it and so shall it be so we understand eh? i feel like it's external forces are just like oh you have to marry i'm comfortable i'm okay god's time is the best anytime i say that my mom just gets so livid like what do you mean god's time is the best <laughs> but really i can't kill myself the goal is not to marry you the goal is to be happy so i'm gonna take my charlotte tilbury spray and spray my face down oh no before i do that i have not contoured my face hello and then another thing that i've started doing again recently that i used to do before the maybelline cacao powder is broken so i can't really show you guys but it's like the darkest powder from maybelline i've been using this for my contour lately and loving it that's what it looks like so this next question i get it a lot i don't know why people 
make such a big deal about it but let me just address it now once and for all you are always showing your mom why don't you show your dad I'm guilty of this also. My mom is a EOP person. I don't know how to explain. Like, my dad is not a camera person. I don't even know whether you agree to do a video with me. I don't even know whether that video will be boring. I don't know. It might be shocking. Like, even my mom self. The first time I ever asked my mom to do a video with me, I didn't even think she would agree. And then when she agreed, I was honestly nervous. I didn't know how the video was going to turn out. I didn't know how she would be in front of the camera. But she surprised me. Like, even herself. She was very, very nervous. The first time I filmed with her, she was so nervous. Like, she just kept saying, I don't want to disappoint you. I don't want to fall your hand. <laughs> it was so cute. So, like, I don't know. My dad might shock me. And the thing is that I don't live in the same place with my parents. My parents live in Asaba, and I live in Lagos. And my mom is the one that will say, I miss my children. I'm going to Lagos. My dad will not just stay and come to Lagos. So do what? <laughs> like, the few times he has come, it's because he had work in Lagos. So yeah, it's not like I'm hiding my dad from you guys. I'm sure people will definitely see me. I'm sure if, I, if you watch my vlogs, so if you've seen my dad a few times on my channel. Will you have a party for your birthday this year? No, boo-boo. Do you know how much I spent for my birthday last year? Some milly milly. I ain't gonna do that this year. I did that because that was my third year. Like, I had to celebrate. I've said this a few times on my channel before, but like my 25th birthday, hmm, when they say when is the low, when was the lowest part of your life, like that was the lowest of the low, sad, depressed. Wanna? I'm making light of it, I know, but like that was the year in my life that I made some poor choices, and that was just because. I was in a very, very down place in my life. I'm going to spray my face now with the shallow tuber. Before when I used to do my makeup, I used to spray at every step so that everything will be melted. I don't know why I stopped doing that. Yeah, so like to go from there to where I am, you know, I needed to celebrate God's goodness in my life because I lived another five years and I'm doing amazing. I'm where I never saw myself being. But yeah, anyways, the question is, will I have a party? No. Maybe people around me surprise me, I don't know. Hint, hint. <laughs> Someone said she misses my Gary D with me video so much that, that the video should be at least 41 minutes long. Anyways, how do you forgive and forget childhood trauma? <laughs> Maybe my sister just looked at me. Eh? <laughs> this is such a strange question right now because I literally was saying a few days ago that I think I need to see a therapist because this past few weeks some things have just come up that I'm like I thought I'd moved past all this I thought I'd forgiven and moved on and then I realized that I'm talking now I feel like tearing up what the hell I realized that I have some childhood trauma that I haven't dealt with that I thought I had I don't know I'm not the right person to ask and I think something triggered it and it's something that i really need to look into all right so now i'm moving to my brows guys i'm running late i'm going to quickly do my brows because i can't talk and do my brows for the life of me so i'll be back with the gist let me finish my brows first and my brows came out fine to do okay it's fine abby and mm. uh, one hand though mm. all right so i'm done feeling it in. i'm going into my mirac flat brush to highlight my brows guys my brows my brows today is giving it's giving everything it's supposed to give and more check it out purr all right so i'm done highlighting my brows now i'm just going to go ahead to blend the concealer all right so the next question is what is your biggest fear in life? I love you so much. I love you too, darling. I don't know, people like asking me this question. My biggest fear in life is to not be happy, to not succeed, for my sisters and I, my family and I, not to succeed. Failure. Failure and unhappiness. That's my biggest fear in life. Is your hair relaxed? I'm asking because my hair can't get so low, even with a gel on it. Yes, my hair is relaxed. I honestly can't do the whole natural hair thing. I even feel like I've gotten to a point that I'm like, okay, Sandra, enough is enough. You need to start taking care of your natural hair. Like, I do not take care of my natural hair at all. And it's showing. Like, today I washed my hair. If you see the amount of hair that fell, I was so scared. 
and it just shows that lack of care. So I, I really like to do ponytails. Like that's my favorite hairstyle to do. Like I literally just losing the ponytail. So like there was a lot of gel build up on my hair. I know mommy is not pushing you for marriage. However, do you feel the pressure? Really? Did you just say that? That means you're not watching my channel. Even in the last video, I did with mom see. She even said it now. If I hear that she's not. The pressure is getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> There's another question there like that. So let me just answer both of them together. Okay, how do you handle pressure to get married from your family, your uncles, aunties? Do you simply say God's time? To be honestly, brutally honest with you, eh, I've gotten to a point that the next person that asks me that question, you know, like my response. <laughs> because I'm too polite, maybe. Because do you know why this thing annoys me so much? Like, I'm so freaking proud of how far I've come. I'm doing so freaking well. They don't see that. <laughs> How are you not seeing that I'm doing so well? All they want to know is, you have not married. That's all. I went for my sister's convocation and one of my uncles was like, yeah, 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 overripe. Very, 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 very overripe. <laughs> like he's, he kept emphasizing it over and over again. Like I just smiled and just didn't respond. But in my mind, I'm like, are you for real right now? Like most of all these posts, they don't even know anything that is going on with me. Or, like they, they're not even asking me, how are you? All they just want to know is, oh, you are 30, you have not married. Ha! Hmm. Hmm. Can you guys leave me alone? Jeez. Do you even know what I want to marry? Is it a Nigerian thing? I would like to know if you are watching from another part of the world because it's, it's crazy on these streets. But yeah, honestly, I just feel like I'm doing so well in every other area of my life. And then... The one area that you feel like I'm not doing well is, is such a big deal. But really, I just feel like God's time is the best time. I'd rather be single than rushing and rush out, to be honest with you. I've always been very big on I wouldn't want to get divorced. So like, I'm not just going to get married because people around me think <laughs> I'm supposed to be married. They will be all right. I be they will follow me to my husband's house. Me. It's just the wedding that they're interested in. After the wedding, oh yeah. I didn't even think guess what I was doing. I just used the same contour powder that I used to contour my face. And I'm just using that as my transition shade. So I got this palette from Huda Beauty a few days ago and I think that's the actual palette I'm going to be using for my makeup look today. There's so many pretty colors here. I don't even know what color I want to do. I think I might use this one, this one called Bold Moves bold moves i think that's what i'm gonna use how did you grow your makeup and cosmetics brand to this to this point to be honest with you guys we are less than a year and the things that god has done for mira cosmetics is is really mind-blowing but the one thing that i will say is that god has really 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 god guys you see how pigmented this eyeshadow is god has been really 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 like i can't even emphasize it enough really 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 faithful and i've been blessed with the best partner ever do you know funny enough eh, when chloe asked me to be her business partner my first instinct was no like <laughs> i couldn't even imagine that scenario happening and then god bless a friend of mine that advised me he was he really sat me down and broke it down for me i don't know why in my head like i would really encourage you guys partnerships is good i don't know why we're raised in a society that doesn't really encourage that like you see people that will even say ha you know how women are you will be quarrel i know but i prayed on it and this person really advised me and i saw it from his point of view because i wasn't even i didn't even sit down to even think about it before i just said no but it turned out to be the best decision ever so i'm gonna go into this shade mm. no i'll go into this one this one right here and put it put it in front two heads are better than one really the reason why miracle has grown like guys it shocks me like sometimes i just sit down and just look at miracle i'm like hey, yes miracle <laughs> it took me a long time to grow life luxury hair it took me a long time to grow life beauty but miracle just came and just psh, 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 psh. like that baby is doing she's growing in grace 
that baby is a story of grace and it's shocking that so a lot of people don't even know it's my brand and it's doing well on its own it's, it makes me so proud i'll just say that my partner is the number one reason why like she has a good head on her shoulders to be honest with you so is the combination of both of us works like she's bringing this to the table i'm bringing this to the table so two of them together magic and the people we've worked with so far to push the product into the market have been amazing. Like, God bless all the influencers we worked with. To be honest, eh, I thought when I have my own makeup brand, I would really be pushing it so much. And I've just come to realize that I don't know why, for some reason I feel like it was easier for me to promote other people's brands. Like, my own brand now, I'm just like, I don't know. I don't know why. I, that's a bad thing. I don't know. But... Other people have really been, like my, our, our influencers have been working better at promoting my brand than I have been. I don't know why. You guys, let me know in the comment section below. I don't know. I'm going to go into this shade called Do It. And what else? Our staff, Christiana. I need to give that girl, like, she did try. And Chloe, like, Chloe, my business partner, literally, she sleeps and breathes and eats Mirac. Like, she's always thinking of Mirac. How can we make Mira better? What can we do? Like, we're always having meeting upon meeting to build our baby. I'm going to give her flowers. I know my, my strong suits. When I come here to make up tutorial, I'm always going to sing Mira, my baby, Mira, my baby. But like, there is a lot more behind the scenes that Chloe is so good at. So yeah, I said all that just to encourage you that find the right person, you know, because there's someone that I could have gone on this journey with and it would have been a big mistake and God forbid maybe it would have folded up by now. So it's just to find the, the right person. I'm going to go into this dark brown right here for the outer corner. It cannot be too laid back people. Like I told you that in this relationship, I'm the more laid back person. I wouldn't really say laid back. I just have... A lot on my plate I have so many businesses I'm a serial entrepreneur so to be honest it's not easy to keep up sometimes you know it can be a bit overwhelming if I'm being honest don't go into bed with someone that's like you basically I don't know why I did not put certain powder under my eyes to catch all these fallouts see it looks like I have pigments on my eyes but it's just eyeshadow I beg you that beauty they try guys I should have done a cut crease. I should have made this eye cut crease. It would have been so bomb. I'm going to go into my face powder and use it to cut my eyes. Like so. How are you doing physically and mentally? You didn't take summer break. I hope you aren't too stressed by it. Ha, oh, God. My subscribers are the sweetest people ever. So, like, I love you guys. Like, sometimes I just feel like, do I deserve you guys? Thank you. I'm doing okay. To be honest, a few days ago, I just... I just felt like Sandra, maybe you need to you need to travel somewhere. Just take a break. But today I don't feel that way. I honestly would have liked to travel to Dubai for my birthday. Even if it's just me. But the restrictions to go to Dubai now and the the flight now is so crazy. Like I planned to go last month, but my sister's passport didn't come out on time. Because now they've changed their ways of doing things. Before, you can just pay someone and just get it ASAP. But like now, apparently, they do it electronically. So it's, it's, it takes longer now. So now that I was not ready to go, the price is like double, triple. Like the accommodation we're supposed to stay in was like one point something before for the 10 days. And now it's like 6 a.m. I was like, I don't understand. All right, so for lashes, I think, I'm not sure yet. I think I might use this one from Wink Lashes in the style Indulge. It might be too full for me, I'm not sure yet. When is Effa coming on your channel? I always enjoy your videos with your male friends answering. I don't have any other male friend though. <laughs> Effa is like, like here in Lagos, Effa is like my, my guy, guy male friend. Okay, do you know, I actually have another male friend, like two. I should bring them. Guys, let me know in the comment section below what you want me to, what kind of videos you want me to do with them because I don't want to do the same videos I've been doing with all my male friends, like something different. And I'll bring it for you guys. All right. Hmm. I, mean, I like full lashes, so, but I don't know. I think this one is a bit too much. I'm going into a Mismetics lash tray. Oh 
my lashes are full. I'm just realizing. I need to. I feel like I'm always buying lashes and they're always finishing. When I talk, the mbola will say, You're having plenty of clients now. I'm like, Are you sure that's the only reason? You're about tiffing my lashes. I'm confused though, the struggle for lashes. All right, so I finally picked a lash. I just put glue on it, so I'm waiting for it to dry. While I'm waiting for it to dry, I'm going to go into another baby of mine, my Mirac Charcoal Black Pencil. This is the blackest pencil you will ever use. Take it to the bank. <laughs> All right, while I'm doing that, let me find another question. There are a lot of mental health questions in this video. I don't know why it's making me so uncomfortable. I don't know whether they told you for something. <laughs> Like if I just be knowing, I had a mental breakdown last year that I already discussed on my channel, but thank God. Would you have a baby outside marriage? Oh no, honey. I'm so against that thing, eh? but if I were to get pregnant now, I definitely wouldn't remove the baby. That's why eh? I've been so careful in my adult life because I know that I wouldn't want to abort a baby. And I wouldn't want to bring a baby when I wasn't ready. Like, I've seen how kids that a few times, not most, not all the time, but some kids that are born outside marriage, like those, those kids tend to suffer sometimes. Well, from my experience, from what I've seen, those kids, it's like the parents are ashamed of them and it, it affects the kids. So I wouldn't want to do that to my child though. I guess see my charcoal pencil, blackest pencil in it. Okay, I don't told you, you better know. All right, so I'm gonna go into this mascara from Nuban Beauty, Surusuke. So I'm gonna apply that on my lashes before I put my false lashes. Any money where I get at the flex, at the ball. Guys, I just heard that song a few days ago and I'm obsessed. I've listened to it a million times. I'm not even really a, a Mr. Easy fan. I don't know why this song is just uh, like on the first day I heard it, I'm like, what? And I'm going out tonight. DJ, come correct. That song must be played. Hmm. One more. I've done my nails now to fix lashes on myself. It's not a problem. Hey, struggle. Wahala. All right, I just spent the last that many minutes struggling with my lashes. I feel like. It's giving one eye open, one eye closed, and I don't know what exactly is wrong. All right, so right now, I'm literally running out the door. My friends are here, and I need to go. Uh, what's your take on long-distance relationship? <laughs> not a fan. I do not like it at all. All right, so for my lips, I'm going to go into the Eye Magic Lip Palette. You guys already know i always do nude on my lips like i don't even try to do anything else if it's not nude it's red and i'm not in the mood for red tonight i don't like long distance relationship i'm a very i'm a clingy girlfriend <laughs> if i miss my man i want to be able to go see my man i'm the one that i miss my man and i'll be doing skype oh my god do you remember skype <laughs> my first my first and only long distance relationship was skype those were the days of skype now it's FaceTime and WhatsApp call <laughs> and, and Snapchat call and Instagram call. See, so many ways though, before it was only Skype. I remember then I was in university, I will now go to my faculty to get strong network to talk to my bobo in Obodo Ibo. <laughs> I don't like it, please. It's very, it's very hard. And it's very hard to build trust in a long distance relationship. But there are people that make it work. I, I applaud you guys, but it's not for me at all. Hi, my question is, do you sometimes feel overwhelmed with all that's going on around you? Definitely. And when I feel like that, I take breaks. See, that's why my phone, my phone, eh? Also, I even feel like I might change my phone number again soon. I don't like phone calls. Phone calls give me anxiety. I put my phone on airplane mode or do not disturb. Airplane, so that you don't even ring at all. Watch movies. Eat. I'm an emotional eater. When I'm in my feelings or overwhelmed by work, family, whatever it is, I eat. Anything to make it a little better. I'm all for it. I'm not going to make my lips glossy today. Because I don't want it to be getting stuck in my hair. I, I dislike that thing so much. Hmm. I don't know what this lips I'm doing now. All right, so now I'm going into my TM Essential Cheek Glaze in Headline. It's a cream blush. It's like my favorite shade for dark skin. You see how that just gave it a bit of a... 
Then I'm gonna go into my Danisa Myricks Dewy Wet Balm in Sweet Water. Ready to put down the highest point of my cheeks. Right here. I'm gonna go into my Fenty Highlighters. We are almost done. We're at the finish line. <laughs> I just refreshed the questions to, to just add a few more before I end this video. And I just saw how is your mental health? <laughs> What is going on? What's your advice for women now hitting 20? I have a video, I have like two videos. I'll link it here for advice for women in their 20s. All right, so now I'm gonna go back into my setting spray, the Charlotte Tilbury spray. All right guys, so this is the finished look. I'm feeling like a snack. I feel so pretty and I love my dress. I feel girly and flirty. You know what I mean? <laughs> Anyways, I'm literally out the door. Like my friends are cursing me out right now. So I have to go. But I really enjoyed this chicha girl doing. I think I'm going to be doing it maybe like monthly or like monthly. Let me know what you guys think, Sha. It's you that's watching. Let me know what you want to see. But yeah, thank you so much for all the questions. If you want, I could actually even do a part two because there's so many questions I didn't get to answer. But if you guys would want a part two, do let me know in the comment section below. I love you guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah!